Fellas from the boat have cleared out finally. Maybe they were, but I'm putting the glock me goggles. Goggles. Where are my goggles? Oh well. What is going on today? Some kind of something. I don't haggle. If you want a lower price, look this elsewhere. Is more delicate work than you're used to. <laughs> I did that engraved piece just last month. This is the party. royal armor lass. I lost my twin piece. sister a while back. Have you ever lost anyone close? I'm not going to answer that question. I made my fortune as a sea captain, but now I'm retired. What I'm going to do is... I gone out here and... Make my way to uh, Riften as fast as I possibly can. I'm expected. Where did I put my goggles? They're in here somewhere, aren't they? Uh. Oh no. I appear to have left my goggles somewhere. That's not great. <laughs> I bet you I dropped him with a children before I left. You know, I could run all the way to Riften, but I could also take a carriage. Hey, horse. Hello. Need a ride? I think so. Where do you want to go? I'd like to go to Riften if that's all right. Uh, hold on. Until next time. I would go to Riften, but we've got problems. <laughs> oh boy! No. That's that's nice. Where'd you go? Yeah, let's use fire against the fire dragon. That's a yeah. Missed. Start burning my hands there. Who? Run. Come here, you big scaly bastard. Why is it? Ooh. Why is it that dragons seem to love Windhelm so much? I thought I could have hit him from here. It's not. Come here, you big scaly bastard. Hello! Down here. Well, miss. Oof. Come on! I think he dodged that. Hello? Finally got your attention. Ooh, yes I did. Nope. Ow, ow, ow. Ooh. Got him. <laughs> Why are you things? Always. Always. Always, always. They just appear to ruin your day and... Also cause a... A wreck load of property damage. <laughs> oh, 
Hello, took care of it, it's fine. As I was saying, I would like to hire your carriage if that's alright. Where do you want to go? Riften? Climb and back and we'll be off. Thanks. How can you be out here in this cold with your arms bare like that? You ready to go yet? Uh-huh. You ever met one of them cats? Khajiit, I think they called themselves. I hear there's whole countries full of them down south. Oh, yeah. Well, say one thing for sure, it's a whole heck of a lot nicer down here than it is up. Hey, speaking of Khajiit. Hello. So many refuse to talk to us. They call us thieves and smugglers. I am glad to see that you are not such a one. Hey, uh, what have you got for sale? Take a look. Have you got any, uh, goggles? Because I seem to have left mine back in Solstein, and, uh, it's not great. Alright, doesn't look like it. Thanks for, uh, bleh, thanks anyway. May your road lead you to warm sands. Uh, you as well. Hopefully my road will lead me to warm... Uh, oh my? What? <laughs> Ooh! Alright. Now where am I going to find an Ultmer in this town? We'll find out, eh? Hello. Take my advice. Don't listen to that talk of the face sculptor down in the ragged flagon. Face butcher is more like it from what I've heard. Oh, that's good to know. I guess I it could have left it behind. I could have put it back where it came from. What? Uh huh. All right. All meat. You look like you could use a drink. What do you say to some cheap mead? Hmm. No thanks. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> I could have left it behind. I could have put it back where it came from. Oh, good lord. Vegetables as crisp. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. I hope I've come to the right place. Alright. Um. Excuse me. I've got a question. If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. I, actually, I'm not really looking for a... Like a room or anything like that. I'm actually looking for a person. Uh, Altmer? Mage, I think? Something like that? Have you seen... Come back and see us you've again. Been in Riften for quite some Have you seen time anyone now, around like that? I fear that you soon may leave us. I believe Riften you're looking for me. Its own. Now is not the time for exploration and discovery. Oh! I'm relieved to hear you say that. Hello. If you were to leave, I'd miss Hello. you terribly. Hello. You must be more good. Erin, I owe you my life. It, it would take a threat to all of Skyrim for me to part. Should we get somewhere a little bit more quiet? I think that might be a good idea. I'll let you lead the way. I assume you know the way to Fort Dawnguard, yes? Hey, let's, uh... Let's head that way and get out of noisy. I could have left it love like a vegetable. I could have crisp as a winter's morning. Like a giant. Only a mere 20 gold coins and all this could be yours. What is that snake oil peddler doing? <laughs> Peddling snake oil, would Welcome you Welcome to Riften, home of the Thieves Guild. Or so they'd have you believe. It's all lies. Okay, now that we're out of the noise... Uh, let me introduce myself properly. Hi, I'm Morgan. You're Hegatha. I am indeed. Uh, you're supposed to be a mage, right? I am a mage, yes. Uh, what are you doing with that great honking thing on your back? It keeps people from asking questions or assuming things. They see the robes and they think mage, and then they see the great sword and they think warrior, and they don't know what to react with. Gotcha! Alright, let's go! <laughs> Nothing more than that? No further questions for me? Well, I've got plenty of questions, but 
first of all, I don't want to be rude, and, uh... I don't know which one to pick first. Understood. So, uh... You're running from someone, right? Yes, and the less we speak of that, the better. Okay, um... Oh, that's not the right way. Alright. Uh, let's see. Drift... Shit, not... Uh, that one. Alright, it's gonna be down the road. And... Jeez. Part of the way into the Velothi Mountains, it looks like. Like, halfway to... Mor... Uh, Mornhold? Geography. I think so. So are you native to Morrowind? Eh, eh, technically speaking, I suppose. Ah, there go a pack of wolves. Oh, hello. Whoa. So you are a mage. <laughs> I did tell you as much. Yeah, my uh, my real mother and father were from Morrowind, and both of them died to ash-related complications when I was really, really young. So I don't really remember much about them. Hello, that looks like trouble. You may want to leave them alone. Think so. That's close enough. I'm warning you. Now ain't this a surprise? Oh. Oh. Time to die, hero. Oh. I told you they don't expect sparks when they see the great sword come out. It's quite a rather useful ploy. Quite a rather useful ploy. Yes. Come on, I know I can get this. Do you need a hand? Nope, got it. Ooh, take that. Hmm. You know, you could have left them here. They were just threatening you. I, I could have, but someone else would have come down this road and would probably get ambushed by him. Someone who looks a little bit richer than I do. Or you do. No offence. <laughs> None taken. I am rather... in enemy territory, shall we say. Not that I have anything against the Stormcloaks, I just... they don't like my kind much, as we've discussed. Hello? Oh, drifting guard. It's all good. Although, technically, I suppose this is Imperial territory now. Wait, what? Oh, you haven't heard? The Dragonborn convened a peace council up at High Hrothgar, and it seems that... Markarth and Riften have traded rulers. Is this the place? Ah. Uh, I think so. It should be, kind of. There's not really a better way in than here, so... Let's go for it. Hello! That's a wee little puppy right there. Hello! Are you a good puppy? Hello! Oh, uh, hello! Snowy dog. <laughs> Not a dog person, I take it. I don't really do well with animals. Hello, um, we're here to join the Dawn Guard. Is, is it okay if we... Now that the Dawn Guard are back, the vampire's reign of terror is about to end. Hi. Ooh, bright. 
I must say, this place is more well defended than I expected. Hey! <laughs> Guess they must have been a recruit for the. For, for, oh, hey you here to join the Dawn Guard too? What? Truth is, uh, I'm a little nervous. I've never done anything like this before. I hope you don't mind if I walk up with you. Hey, uh, don't tell Isran I was afraid to meet him by myself. Not the best first impression for a new vampire hunter, I guess. Uh... Oh, he's going to get eaten alive by these people. No pun intended, considering they are vampire hunters and not actual vampires, but still. You are absolutely not what I was expecting, by the way. Oh? What were you expecting? Well, you know... Mage types tend to be a little... Prissy? Ugh, prissy? No offense? You can't beat me. I wonder what's going on up there. Oh! <laughs> I guess if you ever want to spar with them... A Nord. I don't think I'll ever be inclined to do that. Ooh, there it is. Fix nuts, this is huge. I'm sorry, what did you just say? What, Vex Nuts? I suppose I could go with Shores Balls, but uh, I like Vex Nuts better. <laughs> I came out so wrong. So, are you a, um, a member of the Tribunal Temple? Uh, not really. It's actually raised by Nords, so I'm kind of bored of a... More of a skull than a Dunbar, culturally. One would say, I guess. Look out. Ooh. Where's the way through? Right here. I suppose, coming from... You came from Somerset, right? From Alanor, yes. I suppose you must have seen... more impressive architecture than this, eh? I suppose, yes. Hello, horses. One horse. Two horse. See, you made it up all by your lonesome. New recruits. Hmm. Isran will decide if you've got what it takes. Go on. He's right inside. Alright. This should be good. Uh, you can stay out here if you want. Nope. Alright, he's braver than I thought. So who are you? What do you want? I'm here to join the Dawn Guard, I think. It looks like I might be needed. I should have known it was only a matter of time before they found us. It's the price we pay for openly recruiting. Got a fire in your belly to kill vampires, eh? Good for you. But look around. There's really not much to join yet. As you can see, we have some work to do to restore it to its former glory. But maybe you want to help me with that. Uh, sure. What did you have in mind? I need someone out in the field taking a fight to the damn vampires, while we're getting the fort back into shape. If they're bold enough to attack us here, then this may be bigger than I thought. I have good men here, but... There are people I've met and worked with over the years. We need their skills, their talents. If you can find them, we might have a chance. Alright, who am I looking for? We should keep it small. Too many people and we'll draw unwanted attention to ourselves. I think we'll want Serene Gerard. Breton girl, whip smart and good with tinkering. Fascination with the Dwemer. Weapons in particular. Last I knew, she was out in their reach. Convinced she was about to find the biggest dwarven ruins yet. Might need a little convincing. You'll also want to find Gunmar. 
Big brute of a Nord. Hates vampires almost as much as I do. Got it into his head years back that his experience with animals would help. Trolls in particular, from what I hear. Last I knew he was out scouring Skyrim for more beasts to tame. Bring the two of them back here, and we can get started on coming up with a plan. Sorin and Gunmar, got it. You there. Stop skulking in the shadows and step up here. What's your name? Hegatha, sir. Do I look like a sir to you? I'm not a soldier, and you're not joining the army. Of course. My mistake. Hm. What's your weapon? I'm predominantly a mage and proficient with a number of smaller blades, but I also know which end of a greatsword is the sharp one. <laughs> Stand up, preserve us. That's good enough for me. I think we can make a dawn guard out of you. Here, take this crossbow. Best thing for killing vampires. Find Serene and Gunmar, and maybe we can do something about this mess. I was gonna say, alright, Sorin and Gunmar, but. You two seem a bit on edge. What? Ooh. What is it? Looks like there was a vampire attack. While we were in there. see how good I am with this crossbow thing. Oh. My guess is I'm kind of crap at it. Let's see. Uh, okay. A little farther. Uh, nope. I am pretty crap with a crossbow. You know it's dangerous to run into an active firing range. I thought that wasn't the smartest move I've ever made. So we're going to help this... Help find this Nord and Breton. Hi. So he said Sorim was in Markarth, eh? And Gunmar was somewhere else. Taming wild beasts. Ah. Uh, hmm. Any ideas? Well, I heard a woman in Iverstead complaining about a bear problem. We may want to start there. Where did you come up from, anyway? What? Oh, it's just the training yard again. Hey! <laughs> At some point, I'd like to get some of this armor, because it looks really, really nice. I agree. Maybe better than running around in this, anyway. Doesn't offer much protection. You went quiet all of a sudden. I was just thinking... You know, you don't really need that much protection if I'm gonna be up in the front, yeah? Yes. I was actually thinking, if we do find Gunmar, I may split off from you there. For a while? Well, I do also have business that I want to check in with at the College of Winterhold, so... Oh, excuse me. Now that the Dawn Guard are Ooh, back, excuse me. the vampire's reign of terror is about to end. Yeesh. That deer got way in over his head. Or antlers, I suppose. 
So we'll check uh, Iris dead first. Did I mispronounce it earlier? I may have called it Iverstad, I apologize. No, I think you called it Iverstad. How are you doing on, uh... Uh, potions. I know a few healing spells, I should be fine. Oh, right, I was thinking... Oh, right. We, we... <laughs> Right. Would you like me to come with you to Winterhold? No, I think I can handle that journey on my own. Even though I will have to go up past Winterhold. Winterhold? Windhelm. I get all of these Nord towns confused. You know, I was gonna withhold judgement for when I met you, but occasionally you do say things And I get my hackles up. Oh? Yeah, like these Nord towns. I apologize. It's a hard habit to break. Should which the that way? I must say, speaking of withholding judgment, I did not expect you to sound the way you do. What you mean, like, like I'm from Falskar? Falskar? Ah! Oh. I've been looking for you. I've got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. You came out of the tree and scared Let's the... see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Hey, I'm the kneecap, sir. Ah. What was that about? That's a great question. And I don't really know. This uh, doesn't give me much. Huh? Thirteenth of Frostfall? What is the thirteenth of Frostfall? That would be Mephala's summoning day in High Rock. And I believe Witch's Day. I'm not sure what it's called around here or even if they celebrate. Huh. I am not at all familiar with uh, most celebrations. Hmm. Who's out scouting down beasties? Think we should probably check in the hills, eh? We'll take the scenic route to uh, Everstead, and perhaps uh, if we find him kind of on this road, you won't have as far to go if you have to go to the college after this. That sounds like a decent plan. <gasps> Ugh. We may end up having a camp out here. Maybe not such a good idea after all. Although, you did come up through the mountains so Presumably you're no stranger to camping, eh? That would be a correct assumption. I would recommend not getting involved in whatever that is. Yeah, I, I think you're right. Oop, run into the tree. Why don't we? Or did I leave it? 
I do. I've only got the one tent with the one bedroll. That's all right. It might be a good idea to take watches. I think that's a really good idea, actually. I was going to suggest that, where possible, if we're traveling together, I would rather not spend too much time in large cities. While I do quite like overhearing gossip, I would rather not have uh, give them anything more to gossip about besides just my presence. You know, there's an old man in uh, in Windhelm. Oh, yeah, I don't remember her name, but I know that she's a shopkeeper, and they seem to like her there well enough. Like her well enough there. I don't know what I'm doing. My apologies. I've got a bit of a stutter sometimes. I've noticed. I'm not judging you for it, but I have noticed. Hi, it is rather noticeable. brain just gets squirrely and I start talking to myself and it's... I keep my accents confused. Oop, and it's snowing. I may in fact need something warmer than this to wear. <laughs> I seem to have been ill prepared for the weather. You did say you came through the mountains, eh? That should have been absolutely freezing. It was, but the Geralds aren't actually as cold as the rest of Skyrim. I'm not sure if it has something to do with the humidity or the uh, altitude or latitude or whatever. That's ah, a bear. Hello, bear. You leave us be. And busy. Where he goes, hunting something. I'm not sure that bear is quite right in the head. Hmm. Just barely, all the way over there, you can see that Shrine of Azura. I've heard talk of the Shrine of Azura. Various and sundry Dunwa keep asking me if I've seen it. And now I can say that I have, if from a distance. What was that? That was a dragon? Oh, so that's actually true then. Hi. Welcome to Skyrim. Hello. Oh. Careful. <laughs> Do my best. Seriously, when did you actually arrive in Skyrim? A few days ago. And you haven't seen a dragon yet. These bastards are everywhere. I confess I have not. Well, there's one right over there. Apparently East March tends to be something of a uh, preferred dragon roost. I'm not entirely sure why. But... There's your first dragon. If from a distance. I would prefer not getting any closer to that thing. Oh hey! <laughs> oh, 
I wonder if it has something to do with the volcanic... whatever is going on down there. I suspect it keeps the place warmer than the rest of Skyrim, if only barely. Aye, you're probably right. advice here, if you should ever uh, attempt to go to Solstheim. Don't sleep. Don't sleep. Hi. It's kind of impossible. You'll end up waking up halfway across the island, pounding away at some rock, with a voice in your head. Not a pleasant time. That's a bear. There it goes. What do you say? We keep the... Uh, Keep going, or try to find some place to camp. We still have a bit of daylight left, although... <laughs> Fading though it is. Oh! Hello! That's a big nope. I prefer not camping somewhere with bears around. If it's all the same to you. I can get behind that. So what kind of business have you got up at the college? Just studies. Skiver. <laughs> ah, you better run. Well, oh, there's two of them. <laughs> Oh, well. Seem to be afraid of me now. That's handy. I think I fought four or five skeevers on my way here. Nasty little things. Riddled with disease and... Just not a pleasure to be around. Aye. At least you don't have griffins here. What is a griffin? Oop. Careful on the rocks, it's a little bit gravelly. Have you never seen a griffin before? Nope. Can't say as I have. Well, a griffin is a... Well, it looks like... I suppose a cross between a sabre cat and an eagle. They're... kind of... Pests and shimmering. Oh! I thought that elk was going to charge me. Where am I going? Not sure. Hey, have you ever have you seen a a Nord around? The the uh Hmm. Hmm. This seems like Hmm. Hmm. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Hey. He may be down here, considering that we saw the bear. Bear point. Rock hopping! Oh! Hell. Uh, are you 
Gunmar? You then! Hold fast! Hold. I've tracked this damned bear for two weeks. I'll not let it have any more victims. Uh... Okay, but Isran need your help. Isran needing someone else's help? Never thought I'd hear that. I'm afraid he's a few years too late. I've moved on. I have more important business to attend to. Besides, he can handle anything alone. He assured me so himself. What could he possibly need my help with? Uh, vampires? Vampires? That... well, that might change things. Tell me more about what's going on. Uh, well, I'm not entirely sure, but I know that there's an Elder Scroll involved, and something to do with blotting out the sun? What? Eh. Uh. By the eight. Alright, look. I'll consider it. But I can't just leave this bear to prey on more innocent people. Once it's dealt with, then perhaps I'll see what Isran expects of me. Hey, that's fair. That's more than fair. What's this about an Elder Scroll? Ah, uh, I didn't mention it to Isran because I didn't want to make him panic or anything, but... Uh, uh, yeah, there are... Uh, apparently there's some vampire somewhere that wants to block out the sun. And there's like an uprising going on against him. I'm not sure what the details are, but... That's a bit more serious than I expected. Uh, oop. What in oblivion? Oh lord. You better get up here. Oh. You didn't need my help. No, but I want to know where Gunma went. Oh. Excuse me? You alright? Don't know how well I'd have managed by myself. You have my thanks. You've helped me, so I suppose the least I can do is find out what Isran wants. He's still at that fort near Stendar's beacon, I assume. I... uh... he said to meet him at Fort Dongard. Of course he did. He's been working on that place for years now. Never lets anyone in. Well... His own little fortress. Well, I guess I'll get to see what he's been up to all this time. I'll meet you there. Well, he's made some great progress. I think he'll be impressed. Oof. Did any of those hit you? Uh, well, I'm bleeding, so yeah, probably. You may want to keep an eye on that. Whoa. I'm gonna take this. You're not an archer, as far as I'm aware. I that's true, but... Uh... I've got friends... Who are archers, uh, who might find better use of that bow than me. Really? Hey! Well, kind of friends. Uh, we met once, but... That's, uh... That's scary. I would drag them out of the water, just in case. <laughs> if you can lift one of these things, be my guest. I would also, again, remind you to keep an eye on your wounds. I've heard they can turn you just by biting you. Although I've also heard that there's a ritual involved. I'm not entirely sure which to believe. Hey, I don't know much about werewolves.
Yeesh. What was that book about? Uh, absolutely nothing. All right. <laughs> In that case, we should probably get going before this. Before they start smelling too bad, eh? So, your friend the archer? Mm-hmm. Uh, I've got a, a couple. I suppose. Technically, eh, kind of. I guess we're not even really friends. I mean, I don't really... No one that well. Just some mercenaries. What do you think? Uh, camp up here? I suppose. We could also... Well, I would suggest possibly going to Avastead, but... You may want to talk to those hunters about sleeping here tonight, just in case. We have got to get you some warmer clothes. Yes, and a fire. <laughs> and then I'll be off to the college in the morning. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Right, would you two mind if we set up camp here for the night? All right then. Okay, that'll work. I'll pitch the tent if you want to set up the fire. Sounds good to me. Uh, I don't know if it'll fit up here. Hmm. Might fit here. Uh, uh, not quite. Oh. Sorry. Tell you what, I'll find a spot. You get the camp, the the uh, the camp fire set up, and then you take first watch. I will. And I'll keep the fire going because I'm freezing. That's a good- that- fair. It is fair. Ugh.